Honestly, like my relationship to social media is pretty shallow, I would say. In in not as opposed in, to in the, a depth uh, way, not meaningful. <laughs> Some people have right. meaningful. Yeah, no, they do. They do definitely. I mean, it's not like social media is without its yeah. ability to 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 do something yeah. really positive. I mean, it's already demonstrated right. that. Uh, like I don't feel like I'm an oversharer to begin with. So, um, if anything, I'm I'm sharing more. Hmm. Interesting. What does that say about me? <laughs> I do. Yes, exactly. Yeah, that's what it In says. a way, that yeah, that's exactly what it says. <laughs> if anything, it just made, it reminded me that like the people in our life are not always what they seem to be, and so you really need to trust your gut and not social media. I gotta say, I actually don't do that. I developed that discipline in my early twenties, being on a show like Gossip Girl, where I, you know, clearly I was the object of that kind of, um, and it just, it's a, it's a, it's a wormhole, not even a rabbit hole. So I just, I, it's not did, healthy. Yeah, it's not. And I, and I'm not I, like, I just, I had to develop the discipline out of necessity. So like, so I, I think I started to realize, wow, I don't, I don't do that. And I actually to the point, like, couldn't even really relate so much to Joe in that sense. Like that wasn't something where I was like, oh wow, that's so relatable. Yeah, I do that too. I was just like, this dude's nuts. <laughs> To be honest, I think I sort of thought about those kind of things before being on the show, but definitely. I mean, even just reading bits of it and you're like, oh yeah, of course he'd know that she taught yoga because she tweets about it every Saturday. You know what I mean? So it made me reconsider <laughs> posting in real time as often as I do. And I mean, just being aware. I think Penn and I both had like similar experiences with the shows we were previously on that had a lot to do with technology and making sure to have a lock on your phone and <laughs> just being really careful whenever it came to social media. I, I love social media. I think you can use it well and you could also abuse it, you know? And I think it's a very fine line um, when it comes to it because in a way, yes, it's brought in people a lot closer. In a way, it's also pushed people away. But I think, you know, just being careful about what it is you're putting out there and, and knowing that that's public information then. Yeah, I mean, you just, it's a natural thing. It's, it's not like you have to go to a library to look them up, you have it on your phone. So you want to know more about somebody, Google them, and then you land on their Instagram page. Then you know who their aunt's dog walker is. I knew you were awake because I stalked you. And that's a joke. It's like, who are you stalking now, you know? It's commonly used in this day and age because it is just at our fingertips. Um, but yeah, I've definitely gone down, you know, the hole of Instagram. <laughs>